This is a really, really good question. So seizures change throughout our life because our brain changes. Our brain network connections aren't always the same. So although there are some people out there who've had the same type of seizures for their whole life, there are also people out there whose seizures have changed throughout their life. And that's probably the most common scenario. In this case with Upson seizures, if they're not well controlled earlier on in life, they can definitely progress and evolve. Um, the seizures can become longer, they can become more intense, they can become tonic-clonic seizures. They can even progress to something called juvenile absence epilepsy, which I'll do a different video on, which is similar to childhood, except the seizures are longer. You can have myoclonic seizures with them as well, and they're more likely to progress to tonic-clonic seizures. So to answer the question, generally seizures change because our brains change, our neural networks change, um, our lifestyle triggers change, our hormones change. So seizures can definitely change as our life changes. When it comes specifically to absence seizures, oftentimes they progress or get worse when they're not under the best of control. So I think with any seizures, and in this case as well, um, getting good seizure control will help the seizures from progressing and getting longer and becoming more intense tonic-clonic seizures.